hello guys it's been two months that i have bought my nexus 7 and uh, i should tell you that i have finally rooted my device and i am currently running cyanogen mod 10.1 with motley's kernel i have included the links in the description below you can see uh, the xda forum links where i have got cyanogen mod 10.1 and motley's kernel First let me show you the Cyanogen mod 10.1 version that I'm running so here you can see I'm running Cyanogen mod 10.1 nightly grouper with the kernel <coughs> excuse me the kernel is Motley's, uh, Motley's kernel I should say that uh, this is very snappy and uh, the ROM itself is very smooth as you can see and uh, it's very efficient it's very fast it's very snappy especially the touch i can find i can i find it very smooth much better than the default android version 4.2.1 of course this is the same but uh, this is cyanogen mod i find it very smooth and very snappy and one more thing is that the battery life has been pretty good with this usually i used to get around 40 hours of battery life and around with the same usage i'm getting nearly 48 hours i'm nearly getting two or two and a half days of battery life with uh, cyanogen mod i especially recommend installing um, flashing this cyanogen mod and your on on your nexus 7 um, please root it and unleash the power of your <coughs> android device i would say um, well, one more good thing about uh, Cyanogen mod is that um, these are not uh, shortcuts to settings as in the default Android. Rather, these are toggles. Like when example, I pr I touch it, uh, I tap on the Wi-Fi, then it is switched off, and I just tap. And these are actually toggles, not shortcuts to settings. Of course, you can go to uh, settings by touching and holding. So. So that's it. So uh, this one good thing about Cyanogen mod and uh, battery life is pretty good and uh, you can overclock your Nexus 7 if you will and you can do a lot of stuff when you root your Android device. So that said, I, and I have customized this home screen. I like to keep it very simple. So uh, this is very good and one more thing that i should say it comes signage mod comes with this uh, browser this is not a chrome browser but default android browser generally nexus 7 doesn't ship with this browser uh, it ships with chrome browser chrome for some reasons it's not as smooth or it still has some bugs of course the latest chrome uh, browser beta uh, version is pretty good and is very very fast compared to normal chrome browser but still it's not as good so that's where this browser comes into picture this browser is uh, very good i should say let me show you <coughs> actually this is uh, very smooth i can uh, the touch uh, the pinch to zoom works very smooth and uh, the, uh, this browser is as smooth as it can get and uh, um, works pretty good than firefox or dolphin browser uh, so i would recommend using this browser uh, this has every feature that uh, chrome has to offer maybe it doesn't look as beautiful as chrome but it gets the work done and it's it's awesomely smooth it's it's very smooth in fact it's the best uh, browsing experience i have experienced on my nexus 7 so this is my cyanogen mod 10.1 if you are not yet rooted uh, root your nexus 7 and install cyanogen mod or ava kp rom for the matter and uh, it's it's totally a different experience uh, it's uh, the rom is going to be very smooth experience is going to be very smooth um, so that's it for me guys uh, bye see ya